This is the Football Radio Show Sunday Six Pack. Hello and welcome to the Sunday Six Pack where we crack open six of the tastiest stories in the NFL. Mm. So much madness oh. today, Dave. There could have been a 12 pack. <laughs> yeah, but then we wouldn't be doing the show. Right <laughs> yeah, now, probably would have missed it. Nine awesome morning games. Hard yeah, to whittle it down, six. but let's yeah. go ahead and go back to Thursday night. The Battle of California, the Los Angeles Rams up to San Francisco 49ers. And the Rams win this one 41-39. to 39. Yeah, wow. man. Wow. And it got started early with an interception on the first play. That set up one of three girly touchdowns, dude. He was killer that night. Not to mention killer. How about Goff with three yeah, touchdowns baby. of his own and a 145.8 passer rating for That's Goff. That's good. He's playing some good football suddenly. And it was Woods, Watkins, each with 100 yards receiving and Watkins with two touchdown passes, dude. It was a good game for the Rams. Yeah, man. It sounds like it was a Rams blowout and it wasn't until late. Niners down by 15. Rally. Get an onside <laughs> kick. Recover. Right. And then a phantom pass interference yeah. call. So anticlimactic, ends the game. Great fight by the Niners, but uh, just not enough. And guess what? The Rams are all alone in first place. (laughs) Unbelievable. Somewhere (laughs) Fisher's saying, this ain't no 7-9 and team, right? All right, moving along. It was the New York Giants at the Philadelphia Eagles. Eagles win in a close one, 27-24. Yeah, this game was ugly, really ugly for the Giants until the fourth quarter. That's when OBJ... Had two sick touchdowns. Yeah, Sterling Shepard with a 77-yard touchdown. It looked like this thing was going to go into overtime. But then Billy Elliott. Who? Or Elliott from ET. I don't know. One of these damn <laughs> Elliots hit a 61-yard <laughs> yeah, game-winning field goal. Philadelphia goes crazy. And the Giants leave in heartache. Wow. Still looking for that first win no of the doubt, season. No doubt, dude. Classy uh, t- touchdown celebration there, Odell. Your Giants are in three. Ouch. Wow. Number four. (laughs) All right, up next, we're heading out to Buffalo. It was the Bills hosting the Denver Broncos. And the Bills win this one 26-16. Yeah, man, the Bills got after Trevor Simeon Mm -hmm. all game long, man. They uh, forced a lot of uh, mistakes, but two interceptions. uh, And it was really ultimately, though, a failed fake punt late in this game, late in the third quarter, at the 31-yard line for the Broncos. That set up a field goal. For the Bills, they t- they extended their lead to seven, and then it was the unsportsmanlike conduct on Von Miller, dude. Oh, Whoa. yeah, hey now. that resulted Woo. in another uh, field goal for the Bills as they extended that drive, and uh, that was a little too much for the Broncos to overcome, bro. Yeah, and you look at this Bills team, dude. They are missed. Uh, one Zay Jones catch away from being yeah. undefeated, but my Surprise. question is, where the hell were these Broncos last week, dude? <laughs> or, or week one. Number three. <laughs> oh, man, I'll tell you what. All right, Casey, up next, it was the Atlanta Falcons at the Detroit Lions. The Falcons with a controversial 30-26 to win. Wow. Yeah, both teams coming into this thing undefeated. Atlanta looked like they had control of this yeah. game, but a couple Matt Ryan interceptions, cardiac cats roaring back, coming down there. Ready to take this win, ready to snatch it, dude. Less than 10 seconds to go. Stafford hits Golden Touchdown. Tate. Touchdown! Touchdown! Oh, but Ooh. upon further review, the knee was down, the elbow drops just before the goal line. No touchdown. And to add it, it, make it worse, the officials run the clock. A 10 second runoff apparently was mandatory. Felt like a complete jip. The Lions fans suffering right now. Uh, oh brutal. my God. Brutal, brutal finish. Hey. No, what's not brutal? Winning free stuff. <laughs> yeah. And right. every week of the NFL season, we are giving away a free Skinner case. And today's winner is Nicole's Choice One. Congratulations. You're going to get a free skin. But Dave, tell the peoples how they can get a chance to win. Yeah. If you didn't win, no big deal. Just go ahead and follow at Skin It and then follow foot, at Football RS and then tweet the retweet. And you are in business. Sweet. And if that doesn't work for you, you just want to get a great deal, use FRS20. That is going to save you 20% on all your NFL skins and cases at skinit.com. Deal on the Skinit gear. All right, Dave. Another just great. I mean, it was all great games. One after All nine. day. <laughs> We're going to New England. This might not look great on paper, but it was awesome, dude. Patriots hosting the Texans, and the Patriots win 36-33. to Man, I'll tell you what, in a day of upsets, this one maybe would have been the most unlikely. A rookie quarterback going to Gillette Stadium and beating Tom Brady and Bill Belichick. That would have been big, and they almost got it done. 
Houston defense all over Tom Brady. He's given him tr trouble in the past, but five sacks and then the clowny uh, fumble recovery for a touchdown. It was looking like this was Houston's day, baby, but Brady said, uh-uh, five touchdown passes. That was two to Hogan, two to Cooks, one to mm -hmm. Gronk. And the game winner to Cooks there at the end. Wow, what a game. Holy yeah, moly. Yeah, dude, I was sweating this one myself and you and probably a ton of people out there. This <laughs> yep. was your elimination Survival, game. Survival, man. <laughs> and it didn't look good, but we knew it was going to happen when TB12 got the ball back with just two minutes to go. <laughs> it was money in the bank, and now uh, no rookie quarterback has gone in and beaten a Bill Belichick team at Gillette. But this Deshaun Watson, man, he is going to nice. be a lot of fun to watch, man. This yeah. guy's got superstar written all no over doubt. him. A big game for Deshaun Watson. Over 300 yards, two TDs, but the two picks. So oh. nice performance, though. Number one. <clears throat> all right. Total fantasy domination. Casey, get us started with the quarterback. Uh, it's, not, it's not Case Keenum. <laughs> it's not Blake Bortles. Those guys are fighting for it. Come on, it's Tom Terrific, Tom Brady, yeah. 378 passing yards, six rushing yards, got to get that <laughs> in there, and five, five, five touchdowns. Wow, and it was Todd Gurley, dude, back on Thursday night. Give me now, believe me yards. later. Three touchdowns for Gurley. And Stephon Diggs, baby, 173 yards and two touchdowns. And that stomping of the Buccaneers in Minnesota, don't you know? And then it know? was over in London where Mercedes Lewis did his stuff there with three touchdowns. Wow, Mercedes Lewis. Hello. Yeah, I mean, I'm sure yards. you had him in your draft of kings course. at FanDuel. Why Absolutely. wouldn't you? <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Can't say enough about this week. Such a great week Amazing. of football. We got the early time start in uh, London. And more great football coming up tomorrow night as well. Wow. But, Good stuff. All right. He's Dave. I'm Casey. We are the Football Radio Show.